This quick video will show you how to get the relative frequency of a column in StatCrunch. So here I have some responses. Here I have the tallies or the frequency, right? And the relative frequency is defined as <clears throat> the percentage of that category or that row. So here I have 10 dark, 21 milk, and 9 white. Well, I need to know the total. I need to know how many tallies or frequencies there are. So 21 plus 9 is 30, plus 10 is 40, right? That's the total or the sum. Now, the relative frequency is that percentage over, is that percentage, 10. What, what percent is that of the total? So we have to take the 10 over the 40, get 0.25, so 25%. 21 over the 40, 0.525, and 9 over the 40. So this would be considered the relative frequency. These add up to 1 or 100 percent. They're the, they're the part of the whole. So we have this example here and how do we get our relative frequencies? It's pretty easy. Go to data, compute, and expression. This is where kind of like Excel you type in your functions. So we're gonna build it. I've already done it a couple times but we're gonna build it. So you click build and you have to know the definition. It's the frequency, it's the number that you have over the sum or the total number of all the frequencies, right? So we take the frequency, you add it in there, you divide it by the sum of, of all of these. So then I have to go down to the sum function. And what is it the sum of? It's the sum of the frequencies. There we go. So we take a a part of the frequency and divide it by the sum of the frequencies and that will give me my relative frequency. Click OK, label it relative frequencies and then that's it. Creates a new column with the relative frequencies 0 0.143202271 is the relative frequency or 14.3 percent. It's 296 divided by whatever the total is, right? Let's look at the calculator here. I have this, so I'll add them up. 296, since they didn't give me the total. 402, 918, 428, and 23. Now if I take 296 and divide it by 2067, I should get 0.143 Two, and that's exactly what I get. So that's the relative frequency, 14.3% in this case, and these all add up to 1.